Tarek Skubal goes to work against Connor Joe, and the first pitch is up high. And he's got great stuff when he can control it, like that. He utilized all of his pitches. He'll have to do that today against this pesky Colorado Rockies lineup. That knuckle curve is like the way he is now utilizing all of his pitches. Outside, it's two and two to Connor Joe, who's the in the air to center field. Akil Badu takes care of it for out number one. Here's the Bard earlier going over game plans. There's Randall Gritchick. You remember him from Toronto. One and one to Gritchick. They play him to pull. Another one and two count for Tarek Scoop. 2014. Here's the one two. Little floater into center field and it drops. Gritchick with an eight game hitting streak. A one out single here in the first. All middle in. Not up and in though. One and oh. Don't mind both sides of the plate. Swing and a miss. It's one and one. Except a lot of times when you time out against Kansas City for Scoobal. Here's the one one to Bryant. Foul tipped into the glove of Barnhart. And it's one and two. Bryant was the. The one two. Up high. Good stop by Torkelson at first base. That throw from Barnhart in the dirt. 2 2. Got him looking. <laughs> got today because he's got good, good stuff. Now he faces CJ Crone, the ex Tiger. Watch out there in shallow center. The 1 0. Up high. Here's the 2 0. Right down in the middle. Yeah, Chef, to your point, though, that's just the. The 2 1. Swung on and missed. Early on, Scoobo showing he's got a real good feel for that changeup. Here's the 2 2. Got him swinging. Good start for Tarek Scoobo. He is pumped up, and so is Miguel Cabrera. So happy he was able to do it here at home. Elias Diaz leads off. He's the catcher for Colorado. He is Venezuelan. I I'm going to get emotional when it happens. Pops it up right side. Torkelson is under it. Diaz said he was watching the game against New York the other day. What it means to him is what I think about, Chef. I don't know if we can put it into words. I don't think we can. And I asked. Moment for our entire country because he is such an icon and we view him simple for Miguel Cabrera in the air to left field for Austin Meadows two outs for Tarek Skubal in the second Menards brings you the big money encounter we triple crown in 3,000 hits he's also just the second player with three I mean, the names that Miguel Cabrera is associated with are just revered so. Brendan Rodgers stands in with two away. It's one and two to him. The one two. Pops it up. Grossman in right field. A quick one, two, three. Second for Tarek Skubal. Needed just nine pitches. General manager for the Tigers, who's been so important in Miguel Cabrera's life not just as a baseball player but as a young man when you, you, you. well I mean it was very simple with him he was always a big guy and uh, and a very big strong guy uh, you know average to above average tools because he had a cannon for an arm he had power the the, the his batting stance and his I mean that swing it's it hasn't changed in all these years that's what he had and people don't realize this now because he's older and he's slower but Miguel he actually moves uh, swiftly on uh, in the infield so he's a good fielder cannon for an arm he had power and, and he club and he put on a show at 16 years old you can tell he already at that at that stage he was going to be a very good player good range by Candelario retiring Jose Iglesias and his um, and we never got to see that major league debut well you know how tough this game 
how, how tough this game can be. You've been around this game, so did you think, though, that he would be this good? Like, this is well, stuff you that can't, you never you, think about. You can't, you can't predict the Hall of Famer by any means, no. But I, I can tell you the history of the game. So when you stick your neck out that far, all right, you're thinking, I'm signing a perennial all-star. And we did age. Uh, obviously, you know, his dad uh, and his uncle taught him a lot. His mom, uh, you know, he was a baseball uh, of, of playing baseball and getting through 162 games and being productive because the highs and lows can really kill a player, a young player, and uh, and, 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 and getting into tomorrow, okay? And, and the everyday batting practice and just how to prepare for a game on a daily basis and get through 162 games. He doesn't get a lot of credit for the defense. We talked about the song. Martinez, obviously, those three, when those three guys were here, and, and even Carlos Guillen, I mean, they talked to each other about hitting, about opposing pitchers, and it was just... He knows it's a team sport. You know, he might be 0 for 4, but we still won the game. He's still, he's still happy. That's Chevy's for major league career, but to be able to go back and say, when Miguel Cabrera hit his 3,000th hit, I drove him in with a three touch the baseball. He's playing right field and that's where the base hit was drilled through the right side back in the first inning so far. Well he's at it again Shep attacking the strike zone. Sits him down strikeout number three leads off to ever watch. Bryant softly in right center. But do gives way to Grossman two away former Tiger in this game. I mean, you, you really just you, you can't say enough about how big of a heart he has and how how much of an awe you are of what he's been able to accomplish. Well, isn't that the thing? I mean, the admiration of your and we talk about the big kid in him because he just has so much fun playing this game and it rubs off on his team by calling this game. 2-1 to C.J. Crone inside three and one. 500 together. Now we're calling we call 3,000 and. There was a little emotion that we both had. These, this, this game is about. Crone gets rung up. One, two, three. Go the Rockies. Eleven pitches for t in history, with 500 homers or more, 3,000 hits or more, has dazzled us as well. Four strikeouts so far on the day. It's one and one to Elias. His delivery. And if you notice when he stays in sync like he is right now, I mean he fills up the strike zone. Like he's hitters on the defense. That one's tapped foul. And a, and a different challenge than the pitchers. Another one too. High and away. Off the end of the bat, scope measures it. A soft fly ball out to start the flew out to left his first time up. A first pitch strike. Just miss with the slider at 89. But they love his approach in the batter's box. He's got some pop. Drives the ball to all field. Has done an excellent job over there. Fouled it at the plate. Yeah, I mean, here's a guy that all oh, but lefty on lefty with Scooble out there is a tough assignment. And McMahon goes down looking for Tarek Scooble in the Colorado fifth. Now he gets Brendan Rodgers. One and one to Rodgers. Struggle for him to catch up. Two and one. Swing and a miss. Rogers was Colorado's first round pick, third overall in 2015. Handsome money. You might as well <laughs> make the jump. Fouls it away. Grew up playing on the. Yeah, Shep, the game's in a good place right now with I a agree. lot of young, great, I mean, some great talent. Yeah. It truly is. One of those young talents on the mound today, and Tarek Skubal. Here's the 2 2 into right field. Grossman's got it, and another 1 2 3 frame.
That's what he has been in his career, and that's what that moment was in the first inning. Iglesias on the first pitch, singles to left. That's our Comerica Bank game summary. Tigers, by the way, have banged out 10 hits, collected the five runs. The big blow, of course, besides. The first pitch to Yonatan Daza has accomplished already here today. Holds up and it's 2 and 0. Oh. It's in the streets of Venezuela. Look up to Miguel Cabrera want to be Miguel Cabrera and that they want could be on the field when he accomplished the feat themselves. Inside three and one. Name would be. On the wall out there in baseball on at Comerica Park. Torkelson to second for one. He gets the lead runner. Shep and he talked about Connor Joe with a base hit to left. About his about his mom. He talked about his kids. He said all of this, he just wanted them to be proud. I still laugh when he told his son Christopher, <laughs> I'm gonna bunt for number three thousand. <laughs> and his son's like, come on, Dad. <laughs> and more to come. The one two to Gritchick. Mm, just inside. And oh, by the way, Scooble. The shift is on against Gritchick. This is softly into center. It's down, and the bases are loaded of Rockies with one out here in the sixth. Spits on one in the dirt, one and oh. One oh poked down the first baseline foul. The one one fouled it away. It's Bryant. The one two fouled away. A lot of people thought Chris Bryant might. Another one two struck him out. Oh, oh, oh. 90. Fouls it away. Now one and one to Crone. Bong, just second in the majors. Swung on and missed. Popped it up. Right side. Running for Torkelson. Got it! And Scooble and the Tigers leave him loaded.